hello guys so if you're watching this video right now then you're probably wondering how you can get rid of that message you see on facebook whenever i want to create a new page which says you cannot create a new page again since you already have a lot of pages already created well this doesn't just happen to people with a lot of pages already at times you haven't even created a single page yet you see this notification well there's a solution to it because i personally face this notification on my two accounts both on my account that i've already used to create three to five pages and on a brand new account that i haven't even used to create a page at all so at first i thought it was because both uh, account were logged in on same device so i decided to spread them to various devices still i was still having the same problem so after after a few research i was able to find a problem on how you can actually go around this and then solve that problem and still create your page whether you have a lot of pages or your profile is new you haven't created any pages trust me this uh, trick actually works for any of the account you have so with that, that already said hello guys welcome to this channel welcome to Paris. On this channel, I mainly focus on how you and I can make money online, solve problems related to blogging and content creation so that you get rid of every stopping stone on your way to content creation success. So with that already said, let's get straight on my computer. Let me share with you a step-by-step -step guide on how you can solve this problem. So whether you are using your smartphone or your computer, trust me, this trick remains the same because it's just a minor tweak that you need to do to help you create any account you want, as many as you want. So with that already said, let's get started so to solve this popular facebook problem that says you've created too many pages you cannot create on that page the first thing we need to do is to actually install a vpn into our system so what is a vpn vpn is simply a private uh network that actually gives you a different ip address from your current ip address so it will literally change your ip address on facebook that will enable facebook to give you the opportunity to create a new page so now not every vpn will work for you that's why i'm going to show you the one i recommend and i'm going to show you how this vpn helped me get rid of it as well so now simply come over here to google and i'll search for this vpn so simply type in this word here which says windscribe so we are going to use windscribe vpn so for me i'm using it on firefox so if you are not on firefox you can simply search for if you are google chrome you can search windscribe for chrome or if you're on your phone you can go to your play store or app store and actually download it for free so for me i'll search for windscribe for firefox so I'm actually going to install this extension and then show you how you can get rid of it. So once you come over to your whatever Chrome store or Firefox store, simply click on add to Firefox. So now it's currently adding to Firefox. So this works with any browser you're using, be it Firefox, Google Chrome. So once you install the Winscribe, the Winscribe Chrome extension or Firefox extension or the mobile app, all you simply have to do is come over to, for those using browser, simply go to extension icon click on winscribe to open it up now you have to log in so i already have an account so so for example if you don't have an account you can click on get started and then you can click here free to get up to 10 gigabyte per month uh vpn usage so that you can use it to do this for 100 free or if you already have an account you can simply log in so i'm just going to log in here i'm going to paste my username then type my password So after that, I'll simply click on login. So it will log in, it will log me in into my account. So you can see that I'm logged in right now. I'm just going to skip the tutorial. You can see it has automatically connected me to any random country. So what you can simply do is that you can change the country manually, or you can simply switch it to auto connect. So over here, I'll be using the auto connect to actually create to actually show you how you can create this page. So now once you've connected it like this, you see that everywhere around it will be green. So for example, if I should turn it off right now, it will look pure black. And then once you turn it on, you see that everything will become green. So now you can see it has become green again. Everything has light up. So now I'm going to show you how you can get rid of that problem on Facebook. So now what you simply have to do is come over to Facebook. So once you come over to Facebook, now we are going to create a page with a VPN on. So don't worry. Facebook is not going to block your account because you have a VPN turned on on your system. VPNs are legally um, usage. As long as you don't use for any illegal phishing, you can use VPN for 100% free and it doesn't interrupt anything on your device. Logged in into my account. So I will be using an account that already has pages like three pages to four pages actually connected to it. So if I should come over here right now, you see that I already have four pages with this profile. So whether you have a new profile or an old profile, it doesn't really matter. All you simply have to do is follow the same procedure so you can so you can see that i already have one two three four pages already active with this profile yet i'm still going to create another page with this simple process so all you simply have to do to create a new page is simply come over to your pages just as you create your normal pages and then hit on page 
So now this is going to take you to a tab where you're actually going to create your page. So now here, as usual, just as you create your page, if you're on your mobile phone, I believe you're following the same process, or if you're on your computer, it will be much easier because you'll be doing exactly the same thing just as I'm going through on my own computer. So here, I put in your page name. So let me say, Facebook Pro. My category, Okay, they don't want anybody to use exact name as theirs. Let me just remove one. Okay, you see, they don't want to use the same name as their company name. So over here, I'm going to put news. So I just want to choose any random ones that pop up. So newspaper, then biography, which is option. I'm just going to type some random things. After that, now let's hit on create page and see if we can actually create our page using the same strategy. boom so you can see facebook facebook problem was created now you can add images or go to your page for more details so you can see that we just created the page right now and here you can fill in your other information you see how simple it is to actually create page when you use this strategy so hope you find this video helpful so don't forget to smash that subscribe button like this video and tell me what if you're done in the comment section with that already said have a nice day bye